I want to express my gratitude to the group we have here today from the House representing this caucus, which represents uh, vital communities and very diverse communities within the Asian American Hawaiian, and Na excuse me, and Native Hawaiian and Pacific Islanders community. Uh, what I think most people don't realize is just how diverse it is, how broad it is, how many different dialects, languages, and the like are spoken, which is part of what we have to deal with and solve. And uh, we, uh, we need to stand with the AAPI community uh, and the whole of government response with uh, what we have to get done. Uh, when I came into office, the first, the first uh, bill I signed related to racial equity throughout the government, that's still the plan, that's my objective. And uh, Kamala and I uh, are heartened by the Senate's overwhelming bipartisan effort yesterday, uh, the Senator, for a, a passage of the Hate Crimes Act. Uh, that's a big deal. I mean, it was really close, only, what, 98 votes? Well, I tell you what. But it was really nice. Well, it was not. I thought it was going to pass, but my Lord, yeah, I tell you. I, and we took a vote here in the administration. You're going to handle the jobs bill. Uh, does anybody get 98 votes for anything? Like sure. <laughs> so anyway, I'm looking forward to our discussion with the caucus. And uh, I just want to thank you all for being here. And, and thank you for coming in, Press. Hey, NBC News viewers. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.